Today's video isn't really going to be a talkative one. I'm just gonna let you enjoy the satisfying noises of me unboxing my new laptop and some accessories to go along with it. It's kind of ASMR-ish. I don't know. This isn't an ASMR channel, but I hope you find this fun regardless. Now that I've taken everything out of the box, there's a bit of a long process of setting up the device. I'll skip through most of it, just cause it's not that interesting, honestly. The accessory I've been most excited about has been a brand new mechanical keyboard. I've been wanting to upgrade to the 87 key size from the 60% size for a while now, so I finally splurged. And the keycaps I bought for it are an XDA profile and this matcha themed key set. This tool is for me to pull out the keycaps from the original keyboard. And um, as you can observe here, I'm not very good at it, but I do get better as the video goes on. I'm using cherry brown switches in my keyboard, by the way. It took me over 20 minutes to switch out all of the keycaps, so I'm actually forwarding through this at 1,600 times speed, and I find these noises pretty satisfying, but if you're not a fan, feel free to skip ahead. And now I'm done. 
here is my beautiful new keyboard build. Our next addition is a hard shell case for my new laptop. I am so scared to put stickers on such an expensive device. I don't know what it is about it. It's not like I plan to sell it. I'm probably going to use my laptop till it dies, but like I'm still scared to commit to stickering it. So this star pattern case was my best idea for customizing it in a temporary way. The case also came with a keyboard cover, which I thought would be kind of annoying, but I tried it out and it actually feels so satisfying to type on it. I am a newly converted fan of keyboard covers. I got this beautiful blue laptop sleeve. Not sure why I switched into a British accent there, but it's water resistant, so it'll be great for carrying my laptop around campus. And it has this pocket, which I'll probably use to carry some of my other accessories. The last thing to add was this USB-C like outlet hub and then that's it. That is my final laptop and workspace setup. Let me give you a bit of a tour. I've been seeing so many people on Pinterest and Instagram put their iPad on an easel to use it as a second monitor or just like other useful device with their MacBook and I've still got my trusty $7 white mouse from like five years ago. And that's everything. I've been settling in for a couple weeks now and I've really enjoyed using my new workspace setup. In fact, right now I'm editing this video in this exact position. Wow! I hope you enjoyed this video. I mean, I know I personally loved rewatching that keycap section over and over. But anyways, I upload new videos about student life every week. You can also check out my Instagram, TikTok, and second channel for some other sporadic random content. See you next time!